What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to your Tuning Clan. This is Twin Cow here. Back to you with another Cyberverse Evolve video. This time we're going to be doing no longer than a box opening of the newest Booster Set 6 Paragons of the Coliseum. So we're going to roll the intro and get right with the box opening. <laughs> It's finally here. This is the first post anniversary of Shivers Evolve booster set. The one that will be the beginning of our English second year competitive season with the upcoming Grand Showdown, the conclusion of the Showdown series with the Showdown Challenges into the first of three Grand Showdowns, the Bush Hero Championship series for 2425. This is it. Good cards here. Featuring, of course, we have Koan, Master Omiyogo on the front for Runecraft, and on the back we have the other so called challengers for the Ryu Joke as a bit of an Issei Kai Terminal Swords. We have the Maga, Forest Champion for Forest Craft, of course, Ramya Sonic Racer for Swordcraft. Then we have Ginsexu Great Fox for Abysscraft, and Karula. Arcs Master for Havencraft because no portal craft to this day. And we have some other additions like the new Mysterious Boss who's in I have definitely forgotten, as well as Feling, that associates with the White Frost Whisper, like all the dragon craft players are hunting down for. These are like real leftover ring of Bahamu characters, right? But with that out of the way, we're gonna go ahead and of course start our little box of rings. So we of course Gonna take our little bladed object, take that nice plastic off, you know it's sealed, it came from a somewhat fresh case from none other than one of my own beloved local stores, Center Stage Games in Pittsburgh, California, not Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, don't get those mixed up. When you come down, be sure to give them a visit if it weren't for them. I pretty much wouldn't really be here making content like this for y'all. So definitely go and give us a hug. But this is like by no means sponsor or anything like that. Everything I say is very much my own. So with that, we probably have the boxer and it's kind of kind of fighting it like so. So we're gonna have like anything standing in the way there awkwardly. So one big omission you'll notice with this set compared to the last Booster Set 5 Omens Eternal is the lack of a box stopper of any sort. So it's just be, that's it, the 16 packs, open them and pray pretty much. Right? So we you know, of course, you have some sweeps to bundle up our foils, some premiums that some of my friends are looking forward to. So we go ahead and, of course, start on our left side here, crack that open, and do we get a leaguer? No, we have a forest back. We have crossbow sniper, sword with dragoon, sentry gate. Oh, we have a premium and quick draw maven for swordcraft. Go ahead and set that aside. Spirit shine for fairies, and of course our gold bear pelt warrior. Go ahead and just kind of form three piles there. And we'll have our legendary set to my left side. Go the packs away as I go along, so I don't crowd my. Workspace, so to say. Okay, second pack. Immediately go that away. Magic sediment for our token. We should just space everything. 90 degrees. Dragon Chef, Barrage, Brawler, Charming, Gentleman. First legendary in Wilbur Grand Knight. Take them off to the left there for now. Ice Rancing, Dragon Oog. A Hulking Giant for our gold and Bivka Evolve on top of that. Very nice. Just go ahead and take a swipe break here and um, just like grab a fair handful of these. Get Bivka in there really quick. Already off to a pretty nice start. Bivka is one of those not oh, ubiquitous. Staple neutral as with previous set releases, but it is one of those cards that if you could make a case for this at least worth trying out. Oh, this one's a little harder to open for some reason. One Kill Foss, one of the new tokens referred to on none other than Ginsexu Great Fox. 
Slash King Warrior Seed, Breaking Act Troll, Elven Sentry, Grand Acquisition, Unleashing Nightmare, very important for those. Vampire decks later on. Fan uh, not Phantom, Phoenix Empress for our gold. Alright, pack number four. I will just try to speed up by here. Got many, many things going on. Bottle Fabrication, very funny card. Court League Dance, very, very dope card in Swordcraft. And then I forgot to do the token first this time. Let me not make that mistake. Alrighty. So let's just take a gummy refer to on younger than Kuam, Master of Omiyogo. Got Fall from Grace, a pretty fun little card for some control decks here and there. If you don't mind the opponent healing or you're in a bitchcraft and it's going to ask us out. So that the life gain never mattered in the first place. Got a Paper Shiki Gummy, refer to on a ton of those. Omiyogo, Omiyoji cards. Fun stuff. Focus. Holy Lancer for a premium. And Coliseum on high, very funny card. <laughs> Open 8 is gonna be something with that. And so will Glory Finder. Standard. I'll, I'll praise you if you actually play Coliseum on high and standard. Okay, that, these packs are a little harder to open this time. Make a Orca. Got a bunch of Hunter cards there. Yusuke Rexes Demon, really love this card. And Curse Crafter, Evolve Go on with it. Very useful gold cards over there. Very, very nice. Alright, almost done with the first half. Got a fairy. Cause there's more fairy support. Yay! And we have a wildwood matriarch for our hunter stuff. Okay, that first half had just the two legendary so far, so we're gonna expect the rest of them here. So second half begins. That one opened up quite smoothly. More fairies. Am I gonna sing Amatos? Alright, got a Karuga Archmaster for that legendary and a Garyu Supreme Dragon King, another double legendary pack and White Frost Whisper Gold, very nice. Take a bit of a break there and sweep up our guys. Garyu should have definitely been featuring from the boss since I believe he was the Dragoncraft Challenger representative. But I choose for Lane because they needed some Ring of Bahamut representatives as well. Alrighty, got dragon tokens, cause dragon bladers in here. Oh snap! Oh snap! We 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 did it! We got we got we got a beautiful ultimate vibe card right there. That looks pretty. We got immediately go right over there and sleeve tie up ASAP. That is beautiful. Beautiful. Okay. <laughs> Cross the heroes. Shiki got me summons for a goal. That was a brilliant pack. That was the jackpot. Alright, that probably means no SL. <laughs> but that's fine. We don't need SL where we're going at this point. Alright, we got a mystic artifact. Well, so we're getting here. Manifest devotion for our gold. Funny amulet stuff going on. There we go. More mystic artifacts going on. Worm got the skies for our gold. All right. Oh, it stands if I get on Donkey Mind, so I'll just get rid of the box now. Okay, we got another forest back. Should not be expecting leaguers. Uh, Steadfast Samurai. That thing was a pain back in the heyday in the digital game. If you know, you know. Alright, we got more paper chic gummy. 
Demon Caller, very good. Curse Crafter and Phantom Blade Wielder Evolve for our two goats there. Beautiful. Two more to go. Let's see what else we can still hunt for here. Maybe one more legendary. Holy Falcon. Got a saintly leader for our goal egg. Alrighty, final pack. Will that be a legendary? We will find out. Dragon token. Oh, there you go, it's Adam Cats. Like I said, he would come. <laughs> and Greenbrier Elf for our gold. Alright. Okay, this was an opening. We have definitely seen some goodies here. Of course, uh, could the boys throw off a little Bogus. Wilbur makes for a real supposed war haven archetype since haven crest already is known for that being that wally stuff evolved by cop more of a specialist neutral than anything else not too shabby karuga archmaster for your fungi what we call float haven stuff evolved guardian we never got to see base garu but to really play around with the new Kind of cost five heavy archetype as a way to mess around with Dragoncraft a little more. More of a funny side grade strategy. Amakaz is what makes fairy aggro forest become a real threat. Five five fairies, storm times some number easily kills people. And the beautiful ultimate bike cup. Really, really beautiful looking. That is, that is brilliant. So hopefully you all enjoyed that. Let us know if you have opened up your own packs, boxes of Booster Sex 6, Pergus Coliseum, anything good. <laughs> have you traded for anything? Were you hunting the alt art? I guess alt art, what's it? We'll call it that. Alt art symbol of the War Room Leaguer, but actually Oracle in English for some reason. Or did you want the Cerberus Vigor? Did you get Eager or both? Did you get any of the other f f great looking ultimates? Shout out down below. And with that, thank you all for watching. Continue to embrace the universe. And I will catch you all over in the next video. Bye bye.